Hi butterflies. Okay. I want to make this video for you to show you what I do each time I am creating art or specifically cards for the card deck swap. I literally do this every single time because half of my cards that I create are experimental. I'll show you what I'm doing right now. Half of them are experimental and half of them are intentional. What I mean by that is Half of the cards I'm making for any given swap, I just tell myself I'm going to experiment with processes and new supplies, and I just go to town making a mess and seeing what I can create out of the mess I make. So these were experimental cards, um, and I really like them. The other half of the time, I purposely pull out cards and try to imitate them or mimic them. So this was a card that I imitated from someone else's art. This was a technique that I learned from a swap participant that I wanted to try out. Um, a couple others, like just even background things like these circles, that was a direct imitation of a couple different artists because it's a fairly trendy style. Um, so there, there's just all kinds of uh, things that you can do but what I want to point out is you know if it gives you permission I definitely um, look at other people's cards strategically and then I also experiment and that's what makes me happy is knowing that I'm doing both I'm giving my own artistic spirit freedom to play and I'm also growing my own abilities by looking at other people's art and reverse engineering what they've done so let me show you the first style I'm going to show you, I kind of lovingly refer to in my head as the retiree style, <laughs> which doesn't mean that these people are retired. I just literally don't know how they have the time for this. Um, beautiful, beautiful hand painted cards or hand doodled cards. Um, these are all cards that people have hand drawn, hand painted, hand doodled every single card all 52 and I'm in awe of them but it's also very easy to see how they made this card it's it's just a drawing I can see what this person did they painted a background they painted a flower they took a pen and drew the outline and then they wrote a quote and it turns out beautiful but I can also easily reverse engineer what they did it's very easy to see what someone did they just doodled I could imitate that I don't know that I want to, but I can figure it out. 